United States stands shoulder to shoulder with our NATO allies. The current situation demands that we reinforce the deterrent and defensive posture on NATO's eastern flank. We are moving uh, an additional force of about approximately 2,000 troops from the United States to Europe in the next few days. It's important that we send a strong signal to Mr. Putin and frankly to the world that NATO matters to the United States, it, NATO, it matters to our allies, and we have ironclad Article 5 commitments. Uh, an attack on one is an attack on, on all, and so uh, we know that, uh, that, uh, that he also bristles uh, at NATO. Uh, about NATO, uh, and uh, he has made the, no secret of that. Um, we are making it clear uh, that we're going to be prepared to defend our NATO allies if it comes to that. Hopefully it won't come to that. Nobody wants to see, as I said, conflict's not inevitable. There's no reason for, uh, there, for there to be armed conflict in Ukraine or anywhere else on the European continent. And Mr. Putin uh, can go a long way to, to serving that end. Uh, by taking seriously the proposals that we have put forward diplomatically and by de-escalating through moving some of those troops away.